Welcome back to Zexpress. Today, we'll explore how to create a navigation bar in Canva for your website in the 2024 now. A navigation bar is crucial for any website as it guides your visitor through your site. With Canva user-friendly design tools, you can create a stunning navigation bar even if you're not a professional designer. Let's start crafting your website getaway. So, introduction to the Canva and navigation bars. Canva is an online design platform that offers a wide range of templates and design elements, making it easier to create professional designs. A well-designed navigation bar not only enhances the look of your website, but also improves user experience. So first, you need to have a Canva account. We're gonna leave you a link down below in the description so we can all get started totally for free. Now, starting your navigation bar design. In Canva, you can start from scratch or to use a template. We have now the scratch here, but let's use a template for a navigation bar. In this case, you can go for web banner or header. Let's go here for web header or web banner. And you can see that there's a lot of elements that we can choose. For example, we have this one and there we go. So I choose this element. If you kind of like what you're seeing in here, you can just let it like this. Or let's go for a header, for example. Now pick a template that aligns with your website style and layout. There's a lot of information, but what you wanted to do is to try to aim for the one that best suits for your style, right? So there you have it, guys. So now, what I wanted to do now is to focus into something new, which is adding links and finalizing. So although you can add functional links in Canva, you can lay out where your links or your buttons will be. Use text boxes for your menu items like home, about, services, etc. So once you export your design, you can add functionality in your website builder. For example, here, this is like our top header, right? But here, let's say for example, that I wanted to add something else. I'm gonna to try to copy and paste this text and I'm gonna to try to make it a little bit more smaller. I'm gonna move this like this, for example. I'm gonna just leave it like that. I'm gonna copy and paste exactly the same process. And here, let's go for products. And I'm gonna do exactly the same thing about us. And lastly, I'm gonna just select the three of them. And I'm gonna to try to align the elements into the left part, like that. Like that, really, really easy. So there we go. So now how can I use it to make the actual element as we were talking about into the very first part of video, which is actually just selecting the home section. And then what you want to do is to go for the three dots, link, and here let's go for page number two. Done. And here into products, I'm going to do exactly the same thing. Link, page number three, and the about us linked once again, page number four and hit into done. Just make sure that all of them are actually linked and looking good. Now here to learn more once again, link, uh, page number two, done. There we go. Now here into page number four, remember that we have the about us section, so I would promise. So uh, now what I want to do is to go into show. Uh, we can go into copy the linked or just public view the linked, or I can go into more. I wanted to go for the public view linked, so I created my public view linked. I copy it and I paste it in here, my bad actually. And there we go. So how do I make sure this actually works? I'm gonna click into about us. And there we go. It is actually working really great. Now we start. So what I think that's gonna be just left into my work is a new uh, linked where I can go back into my home, like back where we actually look at instead of just going uh, back and forward. We can go back and home every time we want to click in there. So that's how, guys, we can move on into this actual great, great, great section of the uh, custom navigation bar for your custom website designing into Canva. Export your design and integrate it into your website for a professional look, guys. If this Canva tutorial, guys, were helpful, please give us a thumbs up and subscribe to the Techpress for more design guides. Do you have any questions or tips about designing in Canva? You can share them into the comments below. Thank you for watching and happy designing. Stay tuned for more creativity and easy to follow tutorials. Happy editing, guys. See you next time.